This is a demonstration of a real Flight 9 model of uh, the Erase Griffin VTOL aircraft. Um, the Erase Griffin is a, um, a tilt rotor quadplane. So the front two rotors tilt and the rear two rotors are in fixed orientation. Um, the front two rotors are um, have a higher pitch than the rear motors to give more speed in forward flight. And so what we've got is this model, the, the graphics for the model was created by Brandon McDougall and the original CAD was provided very kindly by Erase, uh, Alex and Adrian from Erase. Thank you very much. And uh, all the texturing and things will be done in a future version. This is a, a very early uh, test version of the model. So we have our control services as expected and we have rudder, and I'll just run a, a motor test so we can see that the front right motor there is spinning up, rear right motor spinning up, rear left motor spinning up, and front left motor spinning up. And uh, if we pop it into first into manual mode, you'll see the servos go to their, their full front position, and I'll pop it into hover mode, and you'll see it going back with the rotors going to vertical. So what I'm going to do now is um, put it into auto mode and do a simple mission where it takes off to 25 metres, flies around these waypoints, comes back and then lands again at the same position, uh, landing vertically. So we've done our pre-flights and we're ready to go. So I'm going to arm the vehicle. So it's taking off up to 25 metres. now going to forward flight and a little bit of your problem going to forward flight that's one of the things that uh, motivated creation of this model improvement of your control in forward transition and uh, we're hoping that this model plus some work with um, with Chris uh, will who's a contributor to the quadplane code will allow us to greatly improve the forward transitions and particularly the yaw handling. So it's now coming around for a VTOL landing. So it's coming in for the approach and it's then going to transition. This is running the current master code. It's not running the new quadplane approach code, which uh, would allow it to gain less height in the transition. So it gains about 10 meters in that back transition. And that's another thing that I'll be using this model for is uh, testing the, the new quad plane back transition and landing code. So it's coming down to, to land there now. Just zoom out a little bit. Turn on sound again and it's on the ground. So it'll then disarm the motors and we will have finished our mission. So, um, yeah, that's a quick demo. There'll be more versions to come uh, with all the, the graphics and things sorted out and some improvements in the um, fidelity of the physics simulation. But I just wanted to show that as a, as a first version. Happy flying.